we're off to Alum's Butchers, a place Jane McDonald has been coming for many years since she was a child. And over there, she went to Wakey Market to buy her meat with her parents. But now, after the market shut, they've had their own butcher's shop open. And this is the home of her favourite pork pies. But aren't we the home of pork pies? So what's so special about these? According to staff at the butchers, it's all about the ingredients. Yes, lard, flour, salt and some boiling water. And then they are hand pressed in these tins. While the proper press is on the stove, heating up, ready to make the pork pie shape. Once the filling is in and the lid is on top and then some glaze, the pork pies are ready to roll. Well, get baked, that is. And these are Jay McDonald's faves. How often do you see her? Uh, not as often as we used to do, because obviously she's a very busy uh, woman now, touring all year. But certainly Christmas times, special occasions, you know, and, 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 and you know, every week, years and years ago, when she first started uh, her singing career, and you used to know Jane from back in the day when she used to buy meat from your market store. Yeah, when we were market traders uh, many years ago, uh, Jane and her mother used to come every Friday, every single Friday, yeah. You know, like Jane, we have a lot of families that have shopped with us, you know, for a similar amount of time, really, you know, which is lovely, you know. The regular customers mean everything to us. Well, all the customers mean everything to us, but, you know, it's quite an achievement to serve people for, you know, 30 or 40 years. I think you know, it's quite, quite proud, really. To Jonathan and his team, pork pies are as Yorkshire as it comes. And the best way to eat Jane McDonald's pork pies? Eat them cold or at room temperature. And a good pork pie doesn't need out fancy on it either, says Jonathan. Sophie Maylan, reporting from Allen's Butchers, Trinity Walk, Wakefield.